God is having a bad time or God is pissed or God is like, why are you doing that? Why are you, you know, that God is also experiencing that range of human emotions, trying to think of what is the highest possibility when I'm screwed like this? What's possible? And I know that sometimes when we can't see our own truth, God is always there looking and believing in that highest possibility. And he can because he's experiencing our anger and our pain with us. So he can from that mud grow the lotus. The guys in our mud, he can grow our lotus. If he was somewhere else, he couldn't do it. But because he's in our, our yucky stuff, that's why he can grow the lotus. If God did not feel angry and pissed off and hurt, and guilty, he wouldn't be able to grow that lotus with us. So God has to feel the total darkness because God must from that darkness create the lotus. So it's not true that God's always light and happy and like perfect, you know, with no Instagram filters. That's not true. God is in our negativity. That's how the possibility of the lotus is born. Remember, from the mud is born my greatness.